Hey guys, it's Phoenix. Ute951121 recently posted an idea on Reddit. Uh, he created a 5x5 bulk tile randomizer uh, using the idea that dropped items have random rotation. Uh, so this was a 5x5 five five uh, tile randomizer. So I've taken that idea and created a 100x100 100 100 tile randomizer. I used a different concept, but it has the same idea. Uh, I'll probably put the link in the description somewhere. Uh, but yeah, it creates a really cool uh, mosaic pattern. Um, this video is actually sped up qu uh, quite a bit, uh, but you can see the effect and it looks really, really cool, I think. Uh, so it is 100 by 100 and it uses quite a bit of redstone. Uh, it actually lagged me quite a bit making this, but uh, you can s I think the, uh, the time was pretty much worth it. It looks really, really cool. Uh, these are normal full blocks. Uh, they're not any nothing special about them. They're just normal wool blocks, and so I'll show you how to make one of these. Uh, so let me just teleport down a bit, and I'll show you how this works. So I've dropped down a little bit. I'm actually still lagging quite a bit, so I've dropped my uh, my chunk distance a little bit. Uh, so let me just break this, and you'll see that there is a whole heap of redstone uh, <laughs> redstone blocks around me. And if I break one of these, you'll see that there's a command block. And actually, let me break a few of them. So he, here is a uh, a set block. So I've actually broken uh, to these redstone blocks to reveal to you that uh, there's actually uh, command blocks pretty much everywhere, uh, just beneath these redstone blocks. Uh, so each one has a different command, but actually it's the same command, but it's actually setting a different type of wall each time. So as soon as I uh, break these command blocks, you'll see what's actually happening. So I have dispensers, and each dispenser has nine command blocks. It has eight now because uh, it's used one of them, obviously. Uh, so each one would have nine different command blocks, and each command block has that uh, set block command, but just a different data value for the for the wall block. And let me go even further down, and you'll see that there are more dispensers and more redstone blocks. <laughs> It uses a lot of redstone, as I said, and you'll see that uh, the, these dispensers have all full nine of them, and there are uh, so 100 by 100, so it's 10,000 uh, dispensers, and uh, obviously I used MC Edit to clone all of these, and you'll see if I go just over here, you'll see what's happening. So I've got two clocks running, and these clocks are just constantly filling the 10, uh, the 100 by 100 area of um, with redstone blocks. And that this set basically does the same thing. So this set of uh, command blocks and these set of command blocks basically s just fill the 100 by 100 area with um with redstone blocks. And if I teleport up a little bit, just one more, uh, you'll see <laughs> the lag. You'll see that there is a lever running a uh, redstone clock, which is running this command, and it's cloning. Uh, the 100 by 100 area of uh, dispensers full of command blocks and cloning them to the area just uh, above the first layer of redstone. So I'll uh, basically show you the cross section of this. So yeah, uh, I'm going to get a dispenser and what's happening is the dispenser is being cloned just over here, just over here, and this actually has the whole set of command blocks. So let me break that, and I'm going to place the, so this is the clone command, I'm going to place the uh, dispenser, and since I've got a clock running, it's basically just going to keep doing this, and cloning the area above, this is actually air, so every time uh, a redstone block is placed, a different command block will be placed, and it's really just doing this constantly, uh, and that's what's creating the random, uh, the random pattern of wall just above. So it's doing this uh, 10,000 times and 20 times a second, so 200,000 times uh, per second, that's why there's a lot of lag, but it creates such a beautiful pattern that you saw at the start of the video. So uh, it does create such a lovely pattern, um, it's really quite just decorative, uh, I don't know, it could be used for a mini game or something, but yeah, uh, I really liked it, and I hope you did as well, and if you did, uh, be sure to leave a like and subscribe to my channel for more creative content, and thanks for watching, take care.